Welcome to the Solid KM University channel. In this video, we'll be talking about installing iMachining 4NX. So iMachining 4NX is our CAM programming software that embeds itself inside of Siemens NX. So how do we, how do we get that? How do we download it? How do we install it? So first thing you want to do is go to the iMachining 4NX website. That's iMachining 4 as in the number 4, nx.com, and register on the website. Definitely, uh, you want to register just for the access to the videos, to the marketing materials, uh, information about the software, anything that's going to help you use the software later on, you'll find on this website. But for sure, when you log in, you'll get access to the download section and access to the various versions of uh, iMachining for NX that we have. So I've already gone ahead and downloaded this, but uh, one advisory before you even click on this icon here to download it is to make sure you disable your antivirus. Antivirus softwares tend to block some of the things that iMachine for NX wants to use to embed itself inside of NX. So you definitely want to make sure you disable your antivirus, as well as set your UAC to zero. Uh, so once you've done that and you've downloaded the software, as I've done here, all you got to do is just double click on it. Okay, and I'll just bring the window over. And the installation is very simple. There's a few things you want to look at when you're going through these windows, but generally it is very simple. You're just going to open it up and we'll say next. You want to agree to the user terms. And this window here, uh, it'll go through the details, but essentially what it means is that um, in NX, if the post processor using, you're using sees that the feed rate is going to reach the maximum or above the feed rate associated with the post, then it'll actually output a G0 instead of uh, G0 instead of the, G, uh, the G1. It's basically going to go into rapid rather than the feed rate. Now, that is an option in your post that you can get to, you can get to be shut off if you need to. Uh, so that's just an advisory of that. And you just click that you read and understood that. Click Next. You're just going to tell it where you'd like to install the software. So the default location is usually OK. So you click on that. Now, this window here, you want to make sure that all of these these directories that you're pointing to are pointing to the current version of NX. Uh, this could be an issue if you have multiple versions of NX installed on your computer, on your hard drive. So if you do have multiple versions, just make sure you look at this and uh, make sure that it's pointing at the current version, the version that you're looking to use with iMachining for NX. So everything looks okay here. I'll just click install. And of course, we'll just go through the motions here. It's a very quick install, as you can see. It's almost done. And what you'll want to do is, um, once it's done, you want to check to see if it actually embedded itself properly inside of NX. So what we'll do is we'll just click Finish, and then I will open my NX. Okay, so now that my NX is open, I'll go to new part. Okay, and I'll just open up a part, just any old file here, just new. Okay, and I'll go file, manufacturing, just to open up the manufacturing mode. Click through these items. Now everything in this part here, you'll see in video one of the, um, the getting started series. I'm just gonna skip ahead here to just going to creating the actual operation to make sure that I have access to iMachining. And you can see there it is in the menu. I'll just click on that, create the operation. And I'll go as far as just checking to make sure that I can open up my user parameters. As you saw in video one, or you will see in video one, um, this is how you create the iMachining toolpath. And you can see here, I have access to everything here. So iMachining for NX has properly installed itself inside of my NX software. Any questions on this or anything else from SolidCam, just give us a call at 1-866-975-1115, extension two. You can send us your parts or your questions via the ticket system at solidcamsupport.com. And stay tuned for the rest of the videos in this YouTube channel. Thanks for watching.